making game assets can be fun. And more so, if you're into low poly asset creation for games and animation, at certain times you probably have experienced that making an asset may look easy until you start creating one. Now imagine making one asset, okay let's make 10 of them, we can push that to 50, we can actually increase that to 100, and let's say you finally end up making over a thousand assets. Imagine finishing this asset, and the minute you're done, you decide to publish them for free on the internet. This is what a couple of artists have been doing for some time now. It is definitely beneficial to the entire community as lots of people will now have access to pre-made models that they can use for their games and also for their animation, which would make them focus more on creating the games and animation rather than reinventing the wheel trying to make these models themselves. And we've talked about a couple of these on the channel before, but today we're looking at one major one and a few honorable mentions that you guys would definitely love. And the one which we're looking at today is Cutaneous. This is definitely one of the places that you need to bookmark, especially if you're into low poly or you're looking for a wide range of low poly assets. As you find once you land on this website, that you get low poly assets that ranges from building to characters, weapons, vehicles, train, trees, animated and static characters, furniture, consumables, fantasy, props, and so on. And most of the models that you're getting here are well done and they do have their own style, which might be appealing to a lot of people. And to get any of these assets, all you need to do is to simply click on the intending one that you want, go to their individual loading page, and from there, you will be able to see the models that are available on these, the format that is available, and also the licenses. So, once you hit the download button, this will launch you to a Google Drive where you can see a clean and organized set of folders. And these can be sorted out as you can search through them and download the models that you want or you can just outrightly download the entire folder. Now within the folders, it is also worth mentioning that you find various file types and also various asset types. Now the asset types you find in individual folders are associated to the naming of the folder. So this is pretty organized. And once you're done scanning through this, you can choose to download one or you can download the entire folder and explore this to your heart's content. Some of the models are fully textured, a few are animated, and others are just happy gray models that are waiting for you to apply some love and texture them however you choose. And this is not all, there are just lots of things to explore once it comes to the kind of models and pieces that you find on this amazing page. Something else to keep in mind is when you're working with a certain group of models which actually deals with various types of animation, you can play them back. So in this case I can just press the playback button and you can see we have that running. And you can easily switch this, so I can go over to the jump section, and if I press playback, you can of course see this. Now, these type of models, or these animated models, are targeted for games. So when you're working in game, you can simply switch between which action you like to get, or which action you like to perform, or you want the character to perform at a given time. And this is in itself a very valuable asset to have. And just like you have with the animation, you can also change or switch the weapons that it has. So in this case, we have this very interesting character and you can switch the weapons and you can also switch the animation, which is something I believe lots of gamers would definitely want to use. So you can explore all the other characters that comes with this pack and you can see even more stuff that exists on the website. The creator has also done a very good gesture of creating a tutorial page within the website itself. And this page actually shares a couple of tips and tricks on how to accomplish setting things in Blender. So in case you're thinking about learning a few things, you can come through, check these things out, and see the most you can get. And for those who like to download the whole bunch at once, then you can consider donating to this creator and supporting him. I would definitely suggest that you bookmark this precious website as it might come in handy for your next project. And speaking about precious websites that you should bookmark, there's also a few that I've talked about on the channel and also a few honorable mentions that we'll talk about right now. So. Poly.pizza is one of them, there is also the Kenny.nl, Devil's Workshop, Max Parthas, and Sketchfab. These are quite notable places that you can find lots of low poly assets. Now I've talked about Sketchfab severally, as this is a community driven platform for free models and these ranges from different categories which you can search through and you can download some of them that are for free and purchase the ones that are not. Kenny also shares a very wonderful similarity with Cutaneous, as artists can actually go in there and hoard as much as they want and get all of these premium assets and work with them. This is super impressive as the low poly assets that you'll be getting with Kenny are very well put together 
And generally, you can use this for both animations and games as the licenses actually support that. And for artists that are considering exploring more options, then you should consider checking out Devil's Workshop and also Max Prater's page. Now, these guys have gotten a couple of nice resources that you can work with and they are super low poly ones that will fit into what you're creating depending on the style that you're going for. And finally, if you're looking for a platform that simply aggregates low poly assets from various sources, then Poly.Pizza is a beautiful one as we've talked about this on the channel before. So this website just simply aggregates so many low poly assets and all you need to do is go over to the search bar and search for any of the assets that you're looking for, click on them, hit the download button, grab them and start working with these assets. Something else to keep in mind is just in case you would like to convert these to assets that you can use directly in Blender, what you need to do is in a case where we have models from Kenny.nl, you can simply select all of them and you can right click, go all the way to Mac as asset and Mac them as asset. Now, if you go over to your asset browser, you can now find this right here. It's also worth mentioning that you can save this and also plug in this file within the file path for your asset library, save your preference, and this would make it completely available all through your entire Blender workflow. So for those who have been thinking about finding a place or places where you can get high quality, low poly models, or probably you're looking for where you can get a start of base for your next model, then you should consider checking out Cotanios, Kenny, Low Poly, Devil's Workshop, Max, Sketchfab, and also a few others that we're going to put in the description. Tell me what you guys think about this one in the comment section. And of course, if you like this video or you like something from this, you can go ahead and give a like and don't forget to share with a friend. And I see you guys in the next one. Peace.